Now the Central Bank of Nigeria on Thursday kicked against plan by the Senate to enact new anti-money laundering laws without required amendment on the existing Money Laundering Prevention Act 2011. This is even as the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission and the Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakam Alami, disagreed on the proposed establishment of proceeds of crimes commission at Inukenuke, covered the Joint Committee at the National Assembly and filed in this report. Divergent positions of agencies of government on proposed legislations by the Senate came to the fore during the public hearing of the Senate Joint Committees on Anti-Corruption and Financial Crimes, Judiciary, Human Rights and Legal Matters, as well as Ethics, Privileges and Public Petitions. In their submission on the legislative proposals, the stakeholders and the financial institutions said an amendment of the existing Money Laundering Prevention Act 2011 will better serve the interest of Nigerians than a repeal and reenactment. We have, however, in line with other bills available today, examined the process of crime recovery and maintenance and management bill 2021, SB 645, and the Public Complaint Commission repeal and reenactment bill 2022, SB 644. And the commission has painstakingly reviewed the two money laundry bill side by side with the aim of identifying which will best suit the context and interest of the nation in relation to combating money laundering. It is therefore with the highest sense of responsibility that we request the passage of SB 789. Earlier in his remarks, the chairman of the Joint Committee said the proposed legislations were aimed at strengthening the fight against corruption. We need to observe certain international commitments and obligations. We are mindful of our nation's sovereignty and should therefore preserve it and also create homegrown solutions to issues in our criminal justice system. The proposed bills are Money Laundering Prevention and Prohibition 2021, Public Complaints Commission, Repeal and Reenactment Bill 2022, and Proceeds of Crimes, Recovery and Management Bill 2021. From the National Assembly, Atinuke Nuke, Silverbed News 24.